This award, ladies and gentlemen, is presented to an athlete, male or female, junior or senior, who is within their first year of state, national or international level competition, and who has excelled in their chosen sport, having shown consistency in performance and dedication to training. So you need to kiss the baby if you the time, you know what that does? Our finalists, ladies and gentlemen, in the 2009 Best Novice Athlete are Jacob McCarthy, Rowan Connors, and Benjamin Lorimer. Congratulations. Now, here, ladies and gentlemen, when I rattle off these achievements, you will see why it's so important we put money into our sports. Our winner, Rowan Crawley. Woo! Twelve year old Rowan has experienced an amazing year through his chosen sport of swimming. He's only been competing for nine months, but after seeing the 2008 Beijing Paralympic Games on the telly, he was inspired, and this is the first time he'd actually encountered sports for people with a disability. In his first event in 2009, the Queensland uh, State Swimming Championships, he discovered his passion for racing. He went home in the first, and the second, and the third, and since February has uh, taken at least 13 seconds. So February, we're in November, taking 13 seconds of his time in his preferred races. His dedication to swimming with art extends beyond the pool. He's continually looking for ways to encourage others with a disability. He writes, and this is, this is just so modern age and makes me feel very old. He writes a weekly online blog. He's made a video about growing up with cerebral palsy and his path to swimming. Rowan participated in the Me and CP Cerebral Palsy Program, which raises awareness for kids, uh, for sport for kids with disabilities. And he writes reports for his school newsletter. You are a busy boy. Congratulations, mate. Well done. sessions a week, five events in the past nine months. He's a terrific primary school student, a great role model for others, and he's good at smiling for the camera too. Uh, and he loves to share his story to help encourage others. So what a year for this rising star. Well done. Our next award, ladies and gentlemen, the most improved junior athlete. And players Craig Oldfield from Bath to hold the winner to present the award. Uh, but amazing association sponsor, they have been with us for such a long time. Uh, thank you so much for their invaluable support. See, we're used to seeing Mark, so you've done a lovely job. Let, let me guess, is she golfing today? Golfing with the Broncos. Well, you scored the good gift. We are much more fun than those Broncos. The most improved junior male athlete, a junior athlete, ladies and gentlemen, is presented to a junior athlete, male or female, who has shown the greatest improvement in performance over the past 12 months. The finalists, 2009, most improved junior athlete are Brendan Hall, Sarah Tate, Rowan Brothers, and Jesse McCormack. Well done to our finalists. And another very big round of applause. Congratulations to Sarah Tate. Again, all more experienced wheelchair races, and it is a tough sport. Produced outstanding times over the past 12 months, and very blingy tonight. Looking gorgeous, well done. Uh, holds the state record for her age and classification of every distance from 100 metres to the 1500 metres, and as well as breaking four or five national records. At the 2009 uh, state champs, uh, she won the Tracy Tracy Freeman Human Athlete. Athlete of the Year Award, uh, involved in two junior development camps, a National League Athlete Camp, how do you have time for this? Not to mention her involvement at state level wheelchair basketball player for the Rollerblades. Inspiration, absolute inspiration, sparkly person, as you can see by the top, to those all around her. Trained several times a week for both the wheelchair track team and wheelchair basketball, uh, and of course has her sights set on being the youngest competitor at London in 2012. Congratulations, Sarah. always sitting with the uh, Sporting Relations Society Association.